I'm going to add a header image to this tutorial and uh, it's going to be two header images one here one behind it and I'm also going to tile an image across the page so we'll start by removing this I'm going to go into my style here scroll down to it's called blog title let's see it's under header blog title here and to remove the text or the title I can do a text indent and to remove it I'll use 9000 pixels minus 9000 pixels and that means it's going to move the text 9000 pixels to the left save it and refresh and it's gone I'll remove this in a moment and to continue on from here I need to go into or what I choose to do I choose to go into the header area here I'm going to paste in some code and to get this to work I need to also move the images into the images folder so I have three different images here one is the tile back which will repeat across the screen uh, header logo and then a uh, banner back okay we'll go back into this because here's the background URL images header logo here's the header logo and uh, I also have there's comma here and URL images banner back both are added the first one I do not want to repeat the logo I want to repeat the banner back X which is basically left and right and background position here is 15% I think it's to the to the right from the left side here to the, and then 50 percent it will move it up and the banner back is one pixel and 80 percent it's going to show a percent down here I can change this and it will modify the position of how these relate to each other and the page and the background color for this uh, is the code right here so I'm going to save this now and we'll see how it works refresh and there it is this is what it looks like right now as I said I can modify these and it will change the position so for instance if I change this to 95 and do a save it's going to push it up a little bit the image is going to go up. This this is the whole area. It's the header section, and it's pretty big. But I can modify that in just a moment. I don't think I need the uh, background color there. I'll just save it because the images are in place. There's a branding here, which is uh, I see a padding 88, and the first number here is the top margin or top padding the second number is the right third is the toward the bottom and the zero here fourth number is to the left so if I change this to for instance 30 and we'll see what happens it moves the whole page upward so what I usually like to do I usually like to add changed so I can see my modifications so I'll just change this to 30 and this section is new So I added this into my header so I changed this what 
there's some there's some text here and I want to remove that so we'll just go into settings general and the tagline here I just can remove it like this save changes I'll do a refresh here and it's gone and it also moved the page up a little bit there's one more thing I want to do in the body section I want to add a background image so I'm going to add this code here body background images tile back I want that to repeat across the screen from left to right. I have also a background position for it. And I guess I don't really need some of these things. I'll just keep this color, background color in it. I believe this is a yellow color. I'm going to save it and do a refresh of the page. And there it is.